The Schmozone, weird and funny sports. We're at Jim Goldstein's house. Who's Jim Goldstein? Fashion, architecture, basketball. Must I say more? Check out our interview. Jim, we got a lot in common. We're both passionate hoops fans. You're from Milwaukee, I'm from Chicago, so we're both Midwest guys. We don't like to follow trends. And we both got pretty good style, huh? Not bad. You were at the Staples Center last night for Kobe's last game. What was it like? Well, of course, even before the game, there was tremendous enthusiasm. Everyone arrived more than one hour before the game. That's unheard of in LA. The VIP room before the game was jam-packed. I couldn't even get a drink at the bar. <laughs> Jim Goldstein seat for Kobe's last game at Staples Center. Was that the best exit you've seen from an NBA player? Well, I don't think there's ever been a buildup for uh, a farewell type of game like there was last night. I don't think there's any human on the planet who's been a live spectator for more quality basketball than you. This is every stash of every playoff game. Well, I don't know too many people that have been around for almost the entire history of the NBA like I have. It's a lot of basketball games. Following it intensely starting in the early 50s. So, you used to play basketball, I imagine, right, big time? I don't know about big time. I played it on my high school team. So, you playing basketball in, a, in your prime versus me playing basketball in my prime, who would win in the game in one-on-one, -on -one? you or the Schmo? I've never seen you play, so how can I answer that question? That's fair, that's fair. I mean, what, what's your style? What's your game? Are you more of a guard? My, my game is outside shooting. Outside shooting. I grew up before the three-point shot, if I had played during the three-point shot era, I would have been pretty tough. <laughs> well, let's get your opinion on one hot topic. The Warriors, 73-9, and nine, set the NBA single season record for most wins. If you were to compare them to the 95-96 Bulls, who's the better team and why? Both of them uh, had average centers. Luke Longley, Andrew Bogut, both Australian centers. That's true. I hadn't thought of that. <laughs> both uh, stiff whites. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, of course, Curry is so different from Michael Jordan. I don't know how you really make that comparison. Here's what I'm thinking, though. Pippen's length. Pippen guards Steph Curry. Jordan guards Clay Thompson. You put Ku coach on Draymond Green. Yeah. Make a match. That's a good analysis. I did grow up in the 90s watching the Bulls play, so I'm a little biased there, but I'm a huge Hoops fan. And one day, I hope I'm lucky enough to travel around all these arenas and see some spectacular ball like you have. Well, it's not easy. You have to uh, be willing to endure airports every single day. I start out the playoff season wondering how am I going to do this for seven weeks? But time flies. I never get bogged down. The excitement, once I reach my destination, carries me through the next day. Now, I want to go downstairs because there's one thing I want to get from you. I think I'm working all right, doing a little throwback action with the Schmo attire, but I want to see your collection. You're a great guy to learn from. So let's go check that out. What do you say? Okay. Let's do it. You're on. So, Jim, this is the hat collection. Unbelievable. How many years did it take you to get all of this? Most of these have been acquired over the last 15 years or so. Why don't you try the feather hat? What do you think? Natural? Goes well? Got to tilt it. Got to tilt, got to tilt it. There, yeah, there I go. All right. The hat collection, everybody. The hat collection. I do want to see your famous closet. This one was custom made for me in Paris. If you want to see more, sure. 
I have to step on the button. Got to step on the button. I wore this last night for Kobe's last game. Kobe's last game jacket right there, ladies and gentlemen. If you can make one fashion recommendation for me, what would it be? It would be uh, hard to know where to start. <laughs> 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 it's not that bad. Come on, come on. <laughs> Big fan. Jim, appreciate your time. Thanks for showing me everything. My pleasure. Jim Goldstein's a great man. He's got great taste in fashion, and I got some great tips. And we talked hoops. I love talking hoops. Thanks for watching, everybody. Who knows who we're going to have next? But as always, I appreciate your time. Till next time.